I'm here today at the Braintree Electric Forecourt, where GridServe are launching a new service that I think is going to revolutionise how people shop for electric vehicles. If you are looking to buy a new EV, you could do it the old-fashioned way. You could trip around dealerships, you could book appointments for test drives and hope that the car that you want to drive is available. You could listen to all the crap from the salesman about why actually you'd be better off with a plug-in hybrid or maybe a diesel would be more suitable because that's what they need to sell this month. Or you could come here to an electric forecourt where you have a number of vehicles available to test drive. You can book online at a time that suits you and you can drive them back to back and you can get exactly what you need from an EV test drive experience. It also forms part of GridServe's sun to wheel model. Provide solar energy from the solar farms, you can charge here at the electric forecourts, and now via their leasing business, you can test drive, you can decide what vehicle's right for you, you can sign up all in one place. It's a fantastic model, and I think it really is a game changer. But let's take a closer look at the cars that they've currently got available. The Polestar 2. I think that's really, really nice. Then. Brakes are good too. I don't think you're going to see the 330 odd WLTP range that we that is claimed for this. I think that is very, very optimistic. The Tesla Model Y. So here it is then, the one you've all been waiting for. First impression when you come in here is that you have stepped into the future. There is massive amounts of space in here. Some people, they really do, you know, worship the Church of Elon and they can do no wrong. And, and I don't think that is the case at all. It's the Mercedes EQB. It just feels like any other Mercedes. And, and, and I do think for transition, we need cars like that. I don't think someone buying one of these would expect it to contain parts from the, the Mercedes Sprinter. No, no shortage of power. I, it's all right. It's the Nissan Leaf. And for a lot of people, I would say this is where the EV experience began. It's a proper car from an actual manufacturer that was a massive step change from crap like, you know, the G-Wiz and, and all that. Am I being daft? Where's the parking brake on this one? <laughs> You'll also have people on hand that are experts in electric vehicles that can answer all your questions and you don't need to put up with what is increasingly becoming an issue where the sales staff at dealerships just don't have the knowledge that you need. How many times have you heard that someone's been trying to use a charger and there's been someone who maybe just picked up their car the day before and they've not got a clue what they're doing? And I mean, I saw it myself in a couple of videos ago, I was talking about someone I met at an Ionity charger who didn't have the first clue what they were doing, had no idea how to start a charge because they just bought an EV, they hadn't been told anything at all by the salesman. They just didn't know what to do. Whereas if, as part of the buying experience, you come here, you'd have a test drive, you chat to the EV gurus that can give you all the information you need and answer all your questions, then you'll be sure that you're making the right decision. And when you're actually out on the road, you're gonna have the knowledge that you need to make sure your experience is as good as possible. The new test drive service being offered by GridServe at their electric forecourts is a great idea if you ask me. Where else will you get the chance to drive multiple new EV models back to back like that? If you're near either Braintree or Norwich, it's as simple as signing up on their website for the available dates and times that suit you for the car or cars that you're interested in driving. I'm told that there'll be a selection of vehicles available at each location at all times and they'll be rotated around to allow people to have as much choice as possible. Of course, when more electric forecourt locations open, this will be even better. In addition, they're also going to be hosting EV awareness days once a month, open to everyone, whether newer experienced EV driver or those interested in making the switch. And it's an event where you can ask questions, you can find out about everything from leasing to charging to sustainability, and of course, take some test drives should you wish to do so. It's in addition to this test drive service that's being offered. 
You'll not need to wait for one of these awareness sessions if all you want to do is turn up and drive one of the available cars. The next EV Awareness Day is in Braintree on the 16th of July, so you might be a little bit late by the time you've seen this video. But the agenda includes test drives of course, charging demonstrations, myth busting for newcomers, an electric fleet session for business owners, a session around how leasing could be more beneficial than buying depending on your circumstances, and even an electric scooter demonstration from mobility company Tier, so you can learn more about e-scooters and what all the fuss is about. There's a link in the description for both more information about the EV Awareness Days and the Test Drive service along with links for booking forms for both, so do check those out if you're interested. I thoroughly enjoyed the test drives I took at Braintree and there's a series of quick test drive reviews for each of the cars featured coming very soon. So if you're new here, do click the subscribe button and make sure that you don't miss out on those because I think if you're in the market for a new EV, they'll definitely be quite interesting for you. Let me know what you think in the comments. Does this type of test drive service appeal to you? I definitely think it's a far better way to decide what works for you and what doesn't than traipsing around a load of dealerships and having to deal with a load of different salesmen trying to sell you stuff. As always, I'd like to extend a huge thank you to GridServe for inviting me to be one of the first to check out this new service and I do hope it goes well for them. Thank all of you as well for watching this video and I'll see you next time.